You're listening to Curious and Interesting, a two-minute podcast on what's new and intriguing in the world of advertising research. I'm Dr. Barbara Phillips, editor of the Journal of Current Issues and Research in Advertising. Consumers like to use technology such as fitness trackers, smartwatches, and phone apps to collect personal health information to learn more about their everyday habits and behaviors. These digital tools also present opportunities for marketers to target consumers with personalized messages based on the data collected. The confidential and sensitive nature of health behaviors, however, raises privacy concerns, even though U.S. law lacks any rules prohibiting the use of such information. Do consumers like receiving highly relevant messages from advertisers, or do they perceive these messages as an invasion of their privacy? Brinson and her colleagues conducted a survey with 400 users of personal health technology to understand what influenced consumer trust in the marketers who collect their data and acceptance of personalized advertising messages. Consumers who felt their devices provided convenient information about their health and fitness that they couldn't get elsewhere were more likely to trust the companies collecting that data. Consumers who liked their devices because they provided status and importance also were more likely to trust marketers and value personalized messages. Consumers who received cash incentives, shopping rewards, or coupons for sharing their health and fitness data also were more likely to trust marketers and value personalized messages. Thus, three strategies advertisers can use to build trust include providing unique and important information, creating fashionable and iconic devices, or giving incentives to consumers. Surprisingly, the authors note that awareness of a company's privacy policy did not increase trust in the company. They suggest that most privacy policies are very confusing to consumers who aren't sure what protections they offer. Thus, another way marketers might be able to build trust that allows personalized messages is to clearly communicate to consumers how they are handling sensitive health and wellness information in a simple and understandable way. Such actions are exceedingly rare and therefore could build brand loyalty. In conclusion, if marketers want consumers to trust them with their health and fitness data, marketers need to earn that trust by giving something back. For more information, this research paper was published in the 2019 issue of the Journal of Current Issues and Research in Advertising. Logo design by the artist Stephanie Ma. Logo production by Cody Schumacher of Island Collective. Music and sound editing by Cheshire Creeper.